Alrighty, welcome back. This is Aussie Gamer 17 and this is my real walkthrough for Red Dead Redemption 2. I am going to 100% complete the game, get all the achievements or trophies for the uh, story mode or single player part of the game. And real walkthrough means that I have played ahead and have some sort of idea and plan to what we're doing. It is not, not a blind playthrough at all. Alright, now, I seem to have lost my hat at the end of the last video. I think we've, um, I've just loaded up my save and it's put us outside Valentine. I think we ended the last video in, inside Valentine, but here we are. I'm just going to grab my hat. That's not my hat. Hang on. That's better. Okay. Now, I've just come across a glitch. Um, I just want to see if it's fixed at all. Uh, no, it hasn't. So sometimes you'll find that down here, uh, let me just, there might be a dead body hanging there where we can find a clue to a serial killer. Uh, I'm just going to leave it like that. I've reloaded saves and tried a few different things to get it to respawn. It's not doing it. Um, so I'm not a hundred percent sure what problem has occurred. Um, let me just try check one other thing yeah this gun needs a clean let's uh, do that so what I'll do is I'll see when we get up to the spot because I've planned in this video to get all three clues so when we get up to clue number two I'll see if that's there and if it's not then I'll know I've definitely done something um, whether you can only do it once and my practice run has um, stuffed it up I'm not sure But yeah, my brother told me about it, so I um, thought I'd check it out for the uh, walkthrough. And now it's not working. So anyway, a lot like the uh, last run I did, we are going to continue doing a lot of side stuff um, before we continue with the uh, final two missions of the story mode before we get to two epilogues. So some big, massive story stuff coming. If you start this mission here, where you've got to go and see Dutch, it's the point of no return, basically, guys. So I'm going to do some side stuff. All of this side stuff I am doing, you can actually do um, after the story. Um, but for reasons that I can't explain right now, I want to continue this a little bit now. Um, but once I finish this run, I'm not sure how many videos this run will be. When I do finish this run, I am going to get to those uh, that story stuff the very next uh, video after that. Anyway, first thing we're doing is we're going to work on a challenge. I'll just open up our challenges. And if we go down to Gambler, open that up. We have to win Five Finger Fillet in Strawberry, Valentine, and Van Horn. And while we're here in Valentine, let's do just that. And it's this. There's two saloons in Valentine. It's uh, this one up here on our right that contains the uh, five finger fillet or whatever it's called one other thing I want to mention before you go too far in this uh, might be a good time to mention it here in Valentine if you don't have warm clothes it's a good idea to grab some I'm not actually going to grab warm clothes I normally have them on my horse but something's happened and they're not there um, we are going to be going to some colder temperatures during this run um, all it means though is I'm going to have to eat extra food to keep our health up our health core. Oh, no one's sitting here. I haven't seen that before. No, I don't want to do solo fillet. What is going on with my game? I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut the video here. I'm just going to go sleep at the uh, hotel or whatever you want to call it and see if that resets a few things. All right, so I'll cut the video here and I'll meet you back. Okay, so I'm back. Uh, it seems to have done the trick. There's someone here now. Alright, and we're going to go win this round. Let's do it. Yep. It's easy. You only have to beat the first opponent. So, A to play. 
He's going to do as many laps as he can, is he? No, in five attempts, is it? Oh, how many laps do you need to do? Oh, okay, one lap. Oh, I forgot to even check what the buttons were. Oh, boy. I stuffed that up then, didn't I? We want to, we want to do that. Alright. Normally, I was a bit distracted. Commentator's curse. Normally, what you want to do so that you know which buttons to press straight away is zoom in. So, A and B. Very easy. Oh, he's hasn't even made one lap yet. I ain't feeling so clever now. All right, A and B it was. Let's go. Boom. That's all we have to do. Win two rounds. Yeah, good move. And and we're out of here. Nah, sorry, buddy. We got other things to do. All right. Now, this may waste some time, but it's eh, relatively on the way. I'm going to go check if we open up the map. I'm going to go check if this uh, murder clue has come back. I hope it has, but if not, we'll go back to plan B again. Or is it plan C? I'm not sure now. <laughs> but we have a lot to get through here on this uh, run. Oh, let's go down this way. Hang on, this isn't the right spot. It's further around. Oh, it's here, it's here. Okay, beautiful, beautiful. All right, so we're back on track now. You can see the body hanging there. And it's got the uh, words on the rocks there. Look on my works. Uh, I forgot that we could, uh, we could have shot that bird. Shoot it just for fun now. Uh, let me worry about that in just a second. So if you see the body here, my gun's not letting me aim for a second there. You can shoot it down, but right here is a map or a note. Inspect it. Yikes. You poor bastard. Yeah, you got that right. All right, so it's part of a picture, which is going to be a map leading us to the killer, actually. And if you flip it over, there's something written on the back as well. All right. And we've got to get three pieces to work it all out. Look, just for completeness, we'll shoot this down. You can't loot it or anything. There we go. And where'd that, uh, what's probably a vulture, where'd it go? Yep, there it is. Let's just pluck it. Because we can. Okay. Alright, open up the map. Next thing we're doing is a legendary fish just down here. That's the picture of it right there. We must have been past it before already. So we're going to fish from about there. Let's head down there and do some fishing. Yep. We're going to get a few um, or solve a few of the treasure maps uh, in this run. We're going to get a few legendary fish, a few of the legendary animal hunts. Um, we are going to get the first, um, what is it called? The ex exotics. 
which is uh, a heap of feathers we have to collect from specific birds and a whole bunch of flowers that we have to collect for this dude. Oh, just a rabbit. And a few other things that I, I'm sure I'm forgetting at the moment. I'll check my notes as we go. Alright, not far now. Ooh. Uh-oh. Hey! Need a hand with your horse? I think he's gonna die. Oh no, it ran off. Hey, hey, come back! Oh no! I'll get it for ya. I wonder if you can jump from my horse to it. I think this is what I'm meant to do for it. Oh, it stopped. I want to... you got to go similar speed. And he slowed right down, didn't he? There we go. Oh, i got to hold it, do I? There we go. Hey. <laughs> Alright, return it. And make sure you whistle to your horse, get him to follow. Here we go. This is not part of the plan either. Oh, this is really nice of you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're welcome, buddy. My thanks as reward. I won't forget this. Means we might see him a little bit later on in the game. Alright, now this horse, we're gonna just give a brush and a feed. There we go. And I'm going to feed Arthur too. Oh, B2 liked that. Uh, I was going to say something wasn't letting me uh, get into things here. Alright. Alright, back to what we were doing. Let's go fishing. I'll tell you what though, I wasn't quite prepared for how much work this was going to be, um, getting tracking down all this side stuff. I have spent hours and hours and hours today tracking this stuff down to the point where I haven't started recording until about 1 in the morning. Yeah, it's just about 1 in the morning now. Alright, let me just double check, make sure we're in the right spot. That looks pretty good. All right, and we are going for the chain, legendary chain pickerel, and we need to use a river lure, a special river lure. Uh, no, that's the wrong lure. Let's put the right lure on. Special river lure, yep. Looks like a river to me, although that's not always the best way to tell. Alright, for those that don't know, I just slowly reel in until we get a bite, just like that. And no reeling while it's struggling like that, and then reel it in as fast as we can. This one was real easy on my practice runs, but they won't all be this easy. Oop. I wonder if this is even it. That was almost too easy. Is that it? It is. Legendary Chain Pickerel. That was easy. Make sure you keep it. And we don't even have to put that one on our horse. Alright, that's it. Put the uh, rod away and get back on the horse. Alright, and now, we're actually going to go get another legendary fish, but we're going to pass through strawberry on the way. So while we're in strawberry, we are going to get another five finger fillet. It's not showing up, I can't remember where it is in strawberry. I think it's actually down this side of strawberry somewhere, so 
Let's just put the marker there and we'll head that way. And some parts of this run, we may have to do a bit of backtracking back and forth to either the post office or the trapper or similar, uh, because we're going to be getting a few legendary fish and legendary animals um, that won't all fit on our horse. So um, I'm trying to do it as streamlined as possible, but sometimes it's just not possible to keep going without um, heading back. Now we do have some mail that, to collect, but we're actually not gonna do that. Um, we, well, we're gonna collect some of the mail, but anything that's cash, we're gonna leave there and collect it later. If you remember a long, long time ago, I warned you guys that as part of the story unfolds, we're actually gonna lose all of our money. We will get back all of our uh, possessions except for our cash. As far as I know, that's still the case. Um, I don't think it's changed, uh, um, but I'm halfway through doing a few tests of that exact, I wonder what that was, um, scenario again now. So I don't want to say it, I don't want to guarantee it, but anyway, so we don't want to have too much cash at the moment. So we're not going to collect anything from the post that is just cash. All right. Another thing to quickly mention is that I'm not going to do too much of the uh, the hunting requests at the moment. I've been practicing a few of those, and what's happening is if it takes too long, some of my animals have been decomposing before I can get them, and you can't post them one at a time. You have to get all of them. I don't know who this guy is. I'll show you what I'm talking about for those that haven't been following along. This is the uh, task here, Wildlife Art Exhibition. If you go into that, we need perfect chipmunk, opossum, oriole, and robin carcasses. Um, but you have to post them all to the uh, quest giver, and they have to all be mailed at the same time. Uh, the, the possum, when you find that, if you, you have to attach it to your horse, and it will slowly decompose. Um, Anyway, okay, there's the five finger fillet showing up on the map. But look where I put the marker, that's not too bad. All right, let's have a go at it. Now there is a trinket that we can get that stops all of the animals from decomposing, but we're not getting that until we head down into the, um, I think it's Austin or something, the state where Blackwater is. All right, same as before really. Sometimes they change the rules a little bit, but uh, most laps in 20 seconds this time. Let's do it. Come on. Come on. A and B, okay, now we can skip. This one will let us. All right, let's do it. And as soon as you've got more than what he had, you can uh, finish your turn. There we go. Round one is ours, one more for the win. And it's that thrilling that we've got a line now, someone else wants to play. Uh, right, make sure we have a look, A and Y, skip. Five, we can beat that. That'll do. That's it. Yeah. Think I'll call it while I got my digits. Yep. You might be, but we aren't gonna be hanging around. Let's get out of here. See ya. Alright. Let's go. Okay. If we open up the map. Like I said before, we're going to get another legendary fish. 
Uh, I think it's up this way somewhere. Let me double check. Up here somewhere, we're going to grab a boat and head out into this lake or whatever it is and grab ourselves the next legendary fish. That's the plan. Let's do it. Uh, and the reason actually we're grabbing a boat, you can do it from the shore. If you head into challenges, is it under survivalist? Yeah, okay. Zero of one fish caught while boating and then zero of one fish caught from railroad tracks. On this run, we're actually gonna be ticking both of those off with legendary fish. Starting right now with the boat. Very simple, just catch a fish whilst out on a boat. It doesn't have to be a legendary fish, but where's the fun in that? Alright, here's the lake. I think I found a boat that hopefully always spawns. I just can't remember exactly where I found it now that I... Yeah, it'll be over here somewhere. Hang on. Okay, it turns out that the uh, boat spawning here is not reliable. So therefore, I'm not going to do the uh, boat part kind of birds hang on uh, just a bunch of ravens scavenging now that actually doesn't count but later in the game that would have counted for one of the challenges that we need I accidentally ran that duck over anyway we don't need any of those so yeah so what, what was I saying yeah the boat has not spawned here so there's actually a legendary fish a little bit later on that we're going to grab where we definitely need a boat. So we'll use that one to grab the boat challenge, all right? Sorry about misleading you there, but it's good to know now, even though on all my practice runs there was a boat there. All right, we need to head over here. And from there, we can uh, fish for this uh, legendary. And the legendary fish is a smallmouth bass, I believe. Yep. And we need to use the lake lure, surprisingly. All right, let's check. We're in the right spot. We'll probably could go a little further south, but we'll try here. Let's do it. Grab my rod out. Change to a lake lure. And out we go. Same as before. Now, if any of these uh, fish put up a massive struggle and it takes too long, I'll probably cut the video or speed the video up. One of the two. Just so that it's not a two hour long video, guys. Did I get a nibble just then? I think I did. No. Here we go. Come on. Come on. See, on all my practice runs, there was a boat here, and I just went out on the boat and did this. Oh, there's fish everywhere. Why aren't they biting? All right, let's reset. And I even... Uh, Tried camping and sleeping, reloading saves. Oh, look at the fish right there at my feet. That's probably him. Let's just reel this in quick. Here we go. That's probably one of the legendaries right there. Here we go. All right. Wait till he stops struggling. Oh, no, he's still struggling and he's jumping out. Here we go. 
I think we've nearly got him in already. Looks like it. Here we go. Is... Oh yeah, that's him. That's got to be it. Well, there won't be any need to cut or speed up that video. Legendary smallmouth bass. Easy as that. Make sure you keep that. And make sure you throw it on your horse. Come here, B2. Present for you. Good boy. Oh, 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 oh. Nearly dropped it. Alright, and because we've got that on board, as I mentioned before, a little bit of backtracking involved here. Um, we're going to the strawberry post office to get rid of this fish. Do a couple other things while we're there. In a way, I'm glad I found that out, that that boat is not reliable. I think I did two or three practice runs of this exact part, and the boat was there every time. There was just a little canoe sitting there for me. Um, so I just assumed, which is obviously dangerous, that it was a um, reliable spawn for a boat, but uh, turns out not to be the case. But at least I can let you guys know that now. Killed something. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, it's just a sign. Oh, there was a bird on it. Uh, I'm just in the habit of looking out for small, bir small birds, guys, because we still do need a few, but that's not actually part of the plan for this video. Um, as with the last... Uh, run I'm whoa what's going on I'll put a few timestamps in the description just so that you know sort of um, if there is something specific you're looking for you can uh, find it there whoa I did not I've never seen that before he just shot himself in the foot that actually scared the crap out of me I didn't shoot ya? God. Alright, this guy's gonna try and get us to do one of his stagecoach robberies, but we don't need that right now. Hey there. You Hector? That's me. Alden tells me you're a discouraged man. Ah, you must be a friend of that Josiah Trelawney. Alright, in that case, I've got something here you might want to take a look at. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, well, we're not here for that. So, first thing we want to do is send mail. Our two legendary fish. Off they go. And while we're here, so we're 5 of 13 now. We'll look at our receive mail. Uh, we do want the invitation from Francis Sinclair. We don't want any cash. We can take the jewellery bag. Rabbit pal, no more cash. Elixir, why not? A chain necklace, sure. Snake oil, horse medicine. Look at all the cash though. Volatile dynamite, a gold nugget we can take. Check out the cash. It's from the uh, cigarette cards mostly, I think. An eagle feather. Don't know why we got that, but anyway, the rest is cash. Whoa, -ho. all right. Oh, no, I missed a miracle tonic. I must have missed a bit. Ah, they change up the uh, order on me. Valerian root. Aged pirate rum. Oh, vintage Civil War handcuffs. Yep, we'll take that. They are used in um, crafting with a fence, actually. But more on that another day. All right. Now it's all cash. And one more thing, I'm not sure, I can't remember if we have any bounties. No, we don't. All right. Next. Oop, oop, no, I did not mean that. Two things, actually. Let's check our satchel. Because I do believe we got this. 
an invitation from the rock carving dude. The carvings, you found the last of them. Oh, wait, uh, hang on. <laughs> wait until I show you what I've pieced together. You'll think I'm a bit buttered. Yeah, well, we already did. Please do not dally. I'm traveling soon and don't want to miss you. See you at my home a bit north of the midway point between Owangila Lake and Strawberry. Well, that's not far from where we've just been. So, so let's open up the map. Oh God, I am pressing the same button, but sometimes it does that instead. Okay, I just need to figure out. Okay, we were gonna, we'll head to Francis first, and then we'll get back to, uh, I think it was another, let me double check. Yeah, another clue for the uh, murder mystery. But we'll go see this first. Let's do it. All right. Suit yourself. Yep. I'm just trying to jump onto the horse then. You can actually do that. I know. Yeah. Nope, nope, nope. Yeah. All right. Now, I, this I will admit, I did not do in my practice run. I have not gone back and spoke to him, so anything that happens here is not really part of the plan or practice or anything like that. That's very rare though for this particular walkthrough. That hasn't happened too often. Oh, that's the guy shooting pots and stuff like that. We've met him a few times. Nah, we're not gonna go sort that out right now. Let's head in here. Alright, here's his little hut. Here we go. Hello? Hello, Mr. Sinclair? Whoa. Can I help you? Oh, I'm sorry for intruding. Uh, Mrs. Sinclair? Yes. How did you know? I'm looking for your husband. My husband? Yeah. He's dead. He's been no. dead since just before Francis was born one year ago. Your husband, Francis, is dead? No, this is Francis. My husband, Tom, is dead. What? I'm a little confused. Yeah. Yes, I think you are. What was your name? Uh, uh, that's not important. Excuse me. Whoa. Is there some sort of time travel thing going on there? No way. I didn't get a reward, did I? Like I said, guys, I had not practiced that. I'm not sure what that was about. I might look into that a little bit further off camera. But anyway, back to the plan. We are headed, if you just look at, at Wallace Station, just to the south of it, across the river, in here somewhere, for a uh, another body, basically. We wanna go find another corpse with another clue to where this murderer might be. Let me just check if we're going the uh, quickest way. Oh, not really. I don't want to go through Strawberry. Let's try and uh, cut the corners. Oh, could be dangerous. But I'll give it a shot. Bloody pigs. Get out of my way. Whew. Yeah, 
I don't want to go up through there. Okay there, boy. Let's try this way. I think we did just bypass Strawberry. Check it out. Oh. Alright. It's always dangerous doing this. I'll uh, run myself off a cliff and die, or have to start the run again or something. But it's late. I can't just uh, go the slow way. Oh, here we go, here we go. Now. Oh, well, we've got a fair way still, don't we? Oh, it's not too far now. Now, the the clue is on a rock. On the rock is going to be... Actually, let me just show you exactly what I'm talking about. It's... No, no. This one. One of three bird of prey killed with tomahawks. There's going to be a couple of birds of prey yep. sitting on the rock, hopefully. Although, the way this recording is going, not everything is... Um, spawning for me the way it usually does so I'm not overly confident but if there is we want to get a couple of tomahawk kills the way that I'm gonna try and do it um, it hasn't always been successful for me is we're gonna get the first one without dead eye so we're gonna just line up a kill and when we kill that first one the second bird is gonna try and fly away that's when we're gonna hit dead eye and see if we can get a dead, dead eye kill But I've found the uh, tomahawk throws to be very unreliable, even in Dead Eye. Alright. Is this it? Yeah, okay. I'm going to leave the horse here so the horse doesn't spook him. Oh, this is the start of the trail. There's some body parts already. Okay. And we're going to grab our tomahawk. Three regular, one improved. So we're going to just use the regular. And I'm going to take some guns with me just in case something else, you know, in case we come across something. Let's maintain that. Just realized it needs a bit of a clean. I love the detail this, uh, the uh, developers went into here. You can see a trail. This, if you follow this, It'll lead us to the exact clue that we're uh, searching for. I wonder if you can actually... Yeah, okay, so then you can focus on the track of the stranger and it leads you to the clue. All right. I knew that you could do that when you get a bit closer. I didn't know you'd be able to do it from here. All right, let me just move this. It's where that corpse is. All right, might be that big rock there. I just don't want to get too close. Okay, okay, I think I can see it now. All right, see the birds? Get our tomahawks ready. Yeah, there's definitely two. You ready, Arthur? All right, I want to try and come at them from a different angle, to be honest. Oh boy, they're going to fly away. Oh well, well, we'll give it our best shot. Oh, it's already flown away. No, let's just get the one that hasn't flown away. Oh, they all flew away on me. There's so many of them. Oh, we got one, we got one. All right, we got one. That was terrible, guys. Sorry about that. Oh, the camera's making me look at this. Yes, yes, yes. All right, let's get the clue. You look at the body here. Do you see the clues on the rock over to your left over here? Alright, 
So that's the second piece and you can flip it over again. Something about you find. All right. The sicko wants to be caught, that's the thing. And just for completeness, let's do this again. Alright. Can I get my tomahawk back? Yes, I can. Oh, I can't believe I did that. Let me just check, make sure it's up to two now. Yeah, okay. Okay, one will do for now then. I bet you they're all, yeah, they're up there, but we're not going to be able to get them with tomahawks. All right, now, do you remember those brothers uh, that were uh, both trying to win the, uh, I guess, the love of a girl? We are going to go see them again. Just up that way. Where is B2? There he is. Good boy. Let's go. Um, let me just check which way do we want to go. No, I don't want to go that way. I want to head this way. We'll keep an eye out for a, a third tomahawk kill. Um... But for now, we're going to get on with the plan. Oop, oop. Now, they should be on the other side of Cumberland Falls over here. I think. jump to horse. Alright, here they are. Here they are. Straight. You are a fool and a nuisance, brother. <laughs> this creepy little toad. I like these guys. Shall I throw him off? This is getting quiet on a Oh, Arthur. How are you? Never better. See, you two haven't changed much. No, he's still a lizard. Cowhead gerbil. Mommy's boy. Manatee. Affluentist charm. Milk. <laughs> you already said that. I did not. <laughs> You're a milk sap. Well, you are all chatter and no testes, dear brother. Helen, I will make you love me if it's the last thing I do. And to prove how suitable I am to make a happy and stable life with, I shall throw myself over the waterfall in just a barrel. And so shall I, just to demonstrate how little your feeble gestures mean, you homunculus. Arthur, please come do the honors and make sure we, um... Uh, oh, you silly little tapeworm of a man. Follow me! Follow you? I was born first. Helen, I love you. Brother, you're living proof of God's remarkable sense of humor! All right. Looks like we're doing it. Press Y. Good luck, crazy bastard. Very crazy. Oh my lord. The fools. The silly fools. I cannot believe they did this. Oh, shush you. Let's go try and find them. All righty. Get on your horse and just head down this way for now. Uh, okay, get on your horse. I suppose we have to All wait way. for it. Yep. They've been carried down a ways. We can't get there from this first path. Oh, I'm sure they'll be fine. They might be. Although last time I did this, it wasn't all foggy. Whatever do you mean? Boy, visibility ain't great. Sir, 
<laughs> oh, 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 oh. Like Alright, down this way, down this way. Well, maybe fate might help. Uh, I don't know if you guys can see, but I'm struggling. Here we go. Sure. Alright, here they are. <laughs> Dear brother, what fools we've been! You're the fool, but a brave one. You might be dense, but you are the noblest man I know! You are a lion! Giant! You are an earth shaker! World conqueror! Let's Ow. not let anything come between us again. Never. Boys? Uh, I... Good lady, adieu. Bewitch. Some other milk sops, we will have none of it. But I, I thought yeah, that... Before this siren calls us to the rocks again, let us away from here. You lead the way, brother. The West awaits. Boys! Boys! <sighs> There's quite some suitors you picked there. I was trying to stop them from killing themselves. No, you, you weren't. Me. Well, probably not. Well, you'll have an easier time. I guess I will. So long. God, I'm not a fan of that. This character. That's one of my least long. favorite characters. No. Her and Mary. Exciting. So far. The smartest man I knew, with positively the least sense. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Well, the way it works. Good luck. Alright, that is the end of O oh Brother. Alrighty. And we're not done, not by a long way. Okay, what time of the day is it? 9.14pm. Alright, what we're going to do is camp till morning. Actually, no, we'll wait till we get closer to our next goal. Well, we're not that far from it. We're heading around about here. And it's actually to hunt this here, the legendary, what is it, Bighorn Ram, I think it's called. But that, I believe, somewhere around there is where the clues actually start for tracking it down. Make sure you bring your favorite gun. All right, let's do this. Uh, how do we get back up here? This way. All right, you know what? What we will do is we'll sleep till morning. Let's set up camp. Get some better visibility, hopefully. Especially for hunting. All right, let's go. Hang on, hang on. Can't just leave it there. Oh, I don't think I've fed Arthur enough in this run yet, actually. Let's try and make up for it here, yeah? We'll eat some of that. And... Some of that. And... Oop! Wrong button. Captain Fumblefingers. Hey, 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 come back here. I'm trying to feed you. Ungrateful. There we go. Time to go, boy. Yeah. Alrighty. Now, have we marked it up right? Yeah, that's where we're heading. Let's go for it. Of course, I've got to get my gun sorted out again, don't I? Yep. <laughs> Jeez, so angry, Arthur. Ooh, nearly got the rabbit. Alright, we're going across this way. Yeah. 
Now, what we want to happen when we're in the right area is the prompt come up on screen. With a lot of these legendary animals, um, it might just be the wrong time or they might not spawn or whatever. If that happens, you just need to leave the area, camp and sleep and then come back and hopefully it'll uh, fix the problem. I feel like we're nearly there. Some of the causes for that particular scenario. Oh, here we go. There we go. There's the prompt. All right. And you can see the little question mark on the mini map, which is the start or the first clue. So I slightly had it a tiny bit wrong, but I knew to head in that sort of area. Like I said, I spent hours practicing these. So this was back at the start and I've, uh, whew, it's really testing my memory. I can tell you that. But anyway, here we go. Okay then. Got a good head start on. All right, as usual, we can uh, run for this first and second clue. I remember it on the tree or something over there. Yep. There it is. Which way was it? This way, yep. And the next one is just here. Alright. Should be able to just about see it over this hill. Oops, I thought I was crouched already. There he is. That should do it. There we go. Another legendary animal bites the dust. Call your horse over before you start skinning. Let's do it. Hey, hey, skin. Legendary ram done. Put it on the back of the horse. It's just a pelt so we don't have to worry about uh, the space on the horse. Jesus B2. Hey, I'm trying to do a walkthrough here. Do that off camera, please. <laughs> all right, guys, going to have to call that a video. I'd like to thank you all very much for watching. If you're enjoying it, please remember to give us a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and also consider supporting me on Patreon. And I will catch you all next time.